Hey guys, welcome back to TomZane.us. Uh, recently I got invited to the music beta by Google and this is one of the most anticipated uh, music services by a lot of people. Obviously we already know that Amazon provides uh, the similar service uh, through their uh, cloud, cloud player and cloud drive service and uh, uh, Apple has their iTunes and uh, recently iOS they're going to offer iTunes match. But this video is focusing on what's uh, Google is offering to uh, sort of keep itself in the in the game of musics and so anyways this is actually my first time logging into the music beta I haven't even uh, completed the process of installation yet so I will um, I'm actually saving this uh, to for this video actually for saving it for the video so you guys can see it firsthand um, so anyways uh, as you can see here we have um, quite a bit of stuff. Uh, the, the laptop goes into your laptop, computer, uh, your iPod, iPad, and your, and your tablet. So let's see uh, the thing. Um, I agree. Not that I ever read them. <clears throat> Add free songs to your music library. Discover new music genres. Blah 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 blah. Get full length. Uh, select as you like. Okay, so I like I like classical. I like country. Definitely. I like I like um, hip hop. Maybe. Uh, let's see. Pop. Okay. Let's see. I like rock. Definitely. Vocal. And uh, I think the world means like um, like international songs. So I like Chinese music, so I'll click that. And add free music is, is a simple application adding the music from your computer to your music library. Install it on any computer where you store music. Okay, so let's see what this is about. I think this is one of their uh, clients. Uh, their clients for your computer so they can scan your current uh, mp3 files from your computer and then it'll upload those music to Google servers or Google music servers for uh, later streaming so let's uh, okay I'll download it okay so it's finished downloading let's run it and it has the same uh, installation interface as any other Google applications uh, Google Talk, Google Chrome all runs this same interface um, so okay it's installing music manager and it's installing um, it's a rather quick download I think it's probably less than a few hundred kilobytes okay it'll help me add my music okay so any other computer or Android device okay so I, I guess you know <laughs> Apple people you know iPad, iPod, iPhone you probably can't run this on it because it, it says Android device only but I'll, I'll, I'll try it anyways Thank you for installing. All right, that's weird. Uh, let's see. Let's see if this works. Okay, there we go. Where do you keep your music collection? iTunes. Uh, do you want to update your uh, on blah blah blah? You can here. Uh, sure. So it is now scanning, um, and it's probably going to. Okay, so let me see what I can do here now. Okay, so this is the main website interface for Google Music. Uh, I'm gonna go over the. Uh, website interface now as as this thing is loading and scanning and uploading probably not gonna be finished before the end of this video uh, I've, you know many many hundreds gigabytes of music and okay so new and recent songs oh nice it's already uh, I think it's already scanned uh, or maybe not I, I, I don't have some of these songs and okay so these are basically these are not my songs but these are recommended songs based on my taste um, 
So let's see if there's any free songs. Let's see if I can play that. And obviously you guys can't hear it because I, I, I'm not recording the sound out of my... Um, or maybe you guys can hear it. Yeah, there we go. Because it's uh, it's playing through my speakers and it's picked up by my uh, microphone. Um, all I can say for now, first impression, it looks really similar to Amazon's uh, cloud player, especially the uh, the graphics user interface on the bottom here. Now I don't know if I can. Okay, so I can only add music from my computer, um, and I can only search my library. I was wondering if I can actually purchase music on uh, Music Beta, but I guess not. Um, All right, guys. Uh, so the uh, thing has finished scanning um, my music library. So let's click next. Um, it's time to listen. If you have, okay. So let's go to the music player. Um, I think it should be in the process of uploading. Um, I do recognize this as one of my albums. All right, so basically I think what's happening now is it's uploading. Um, okay, so as you can see, it's uploading uh, the music. It's four of 277 songs added. Um, I have a lot more in other folders. Um, so you can upload music uh, automatic. So whenever I purchase a new music onto iTunes, and as long as the music manager by Google is running in the background, it will automatically upload that music newly added to the iTunes to the Google uh, Music Beta server. Or I can set it uh, checking it every hour, every day, every week, or manually if I just press the start uh, start upload button. Uh, and the bandwidth, uh, I can set it as fast as possible or whatever you like. And I can check, you know, start automatically. I don't want that. And send OK. And I can press apply. And actually, um, let me set manually. So, and OK, so that is that. And um, remember how I mentioned earlier that I was wondering if you can actually purchase music. So let's say, let's get some black IPs. Uh, obviously it's searching in my uh, collection and obviously I haven't uploaded uh, any black IPs up to their server yet, so nothing is found. And here's what I found out. Uh, music purchasing features were absent when it was launched. And uh, so the reason is that the major labels, companies were not, uh, didn't agree to do business with Google. So Google have decided to make Music Beta a stand standalone streaming service, which I think is the biggest flaw in this because, you know, the reason that you want something like this is, you know, especially coming from Google, is obviously you want to make sure you, you're able to not just be able to um, you know listen to your own collection but discover more collections uh, and purchase them on, on the go and I think um, this will probably set back Google Music Beta a lot because you know that's a huge problem but anyways that's all that's for you guys to decide whether or not you're gonna try it out but you know you do have to actually get invited by Google first um, so if you ask me, I actually like Amazon uh, MP3 uh, because uh, they, you know, it's cheaper than iTunes and the collection is just as much and sometimes even more than what iTunes has to offer. 
So anyways guys, quick video on uh, the music beta by Google and be sure to uh, check out my channel. My channel is tomzang.us um, and tell your friends about it. It really helps me out a lot. Um, I'm trying to uh, get more subscribers and more views and you know really helps the channel quite a bit. Uh, so anyways, please do, if you have a moment, comment and rate on this video and, uh, um, you know, all the comments will be read and responded. Um, so uh, please do that and su subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, so that's all for me today, folks. And until next time, I'll see you here at TomZen.us. Thanks.